Hey guys, what's going on? It's Cubic here, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. Um, so I've been doing some things off camera around uh, the base. Um, I extended these bridges. Oh, there's a. Let me see if I can. I think I really got those. I already got four arrows. Let's see if we can take her out here. There we go. Um, but I've extended these bridges. I went all the way over here, so we've access uh, to this part of the, I guess, area um, that we don't have to swim across. For some reason, there's like a seen amount of pigs coming on this bridge. I'm not sure why. Um, but uh, yeah, so I also extended all the way over here. Um, so I do have to clear out a little bit of area here, but. Um, so that way we can get over to kind of this area as well. Get ready you. Um, but I, but a lot of the off-camera stuff that I did uh, came around inside the base. Um, so I started adding grass to, into my base. Uh, it hasn't really gotten too too far. I started up here, and grass takes forever to grow. Um, but I put uh, dirt going throughout the base here. Ex eventually, uh, we're going to uh, break down these walls and do a design and everything. But uh, on the inside here, I added this room. Um, did some mining and got this room kind of to an area that I want it at. Um, I also add pumpkins down here because we're going to be making a or ma be making jack o' lanterns. But uh, I also did some off-camera mining and if we look in this chest uh, we have a diamond pickaxe and 16 obsidian um, about four of those is going to go towards an enchantment table that we actually can make because of having nine diamonds um, and to make sure that I promised I would do or I promised myself I would do this show you guys that I can't cheat these in do not have permission. My uh, world is set to survival mode only. Um, so I can't cheat these in. I legitimately got these. Um, and uh, if we look over here, you can see uh, this mine shaft goes all the way down. Uh, but we're going to be building uh, another portal today. So let's get the obsidian we need. I'm going to I'm going to be building this 3x3 three three because this is an uneven uh, area and I want this portal to be centered. There's too many areas that I build that the portals aren't centered uh, exactly. So um, let's quickly get that. Uh, I made a bunch of stone pickaxes because I wanted to do some more mining and just never did. Um, but we have a, a ridiculous amount of cobblestone. Um, Along with, uh, I wanted to uh, work on. Hear that zombie? <laughs> uh, I wanted to work on building in that new area. So what we're going to need is I want some andesite. Um, I guess we can put some diorite in as well. Um, we're going to convert these all into spruce wood planks, and then we're going to make. Uh, that should be a good number eight uh, spruce stairs um, so yeah let's quickly get over here um, what I want to do is put the stairs along here I did not bring enough of those of course the last one misplaces um, let's get that going and I guess right here we can put a crafting table quickly do that let's see I think Four, no, we're gonna need five. Um, get these spruce stairs going. Um, I saw this design online, and I thought it was pretty interesting, and I wanted to try and duplicate it. Um, but let's quickly do this. Oops. Misplacing box blocks like crazy here. Um, let's see. Maybe so like this will do this stair like so. Nope. Didn't place 
right. Um, that stair like so. Yeah, that looks better. And then uh, we'll make some spruce fence as well to go along the sides here. Um, I don't think we have enough spruce wood to, to finish this off, but we're going to just make this a flat wall and then we'll make uh, some maps and things like that to put on this wall so that it won't look uh, so blank. Um, I'm just thinking about this. Maybe if we... Let's make that into some diorite. Put some diorite there instead. Yeah, I think that looks a little bit better. Let's do that. And then we'll do that one. Mm. Need some work. Um, I think we might be shortchanging this a little bit. We might, instead, let's do that, that. I think that might work a little bit better. Uh, but let's quickly get some more spruce wood. Kind of work on this room. Um, so I do apologize for this video. It's probably going to come out a little bit late. Um, I my recording schedule is pretty much like this. Like I record uh, videos the day before I release them. Um, so like. For instance, uh, for you guys, yesterday's video, uh, I recorded actually Monday, and uh, and also uh, episode one of my uh, Let's Play, I recorded uh, the day before that, so uh, that's kind of my recording schedule, but uh, it's, it's going to kind of change a little bit. Um, due to the fact that um, I kind of realized as I edited uh, yesterday's video, episode 2, um, that it, there's a lot of extra work that uh, needs to be done to make videos, like you know, working on the template and so forth, and it just kind of occurred to me that maybe recording every day is not going to be a good idea. So instead of you know recording uh, you know Monday through Thursday um, like I showed in the schedule last episode um, instead of recording Monday through Thursday um, recording uh, Monday Wednesday uh, Friday and Saturday um, which I think will work a lot better um, than just what I've been doing, or what I've been trying to do. Um, I think also it'll just, uh, help me pace myself a little bit better. Um, but also this Saturday I've got a, uh, graduation party going on that I have to go to, and so, uh, I will not, so... I know, like I said, uh, Saturday Smash mini games. That will still happen, except I'm going to record it Friday and just have it uploading Saturday instead of trying to, you know, uh, record it Saturday and upload Saturday like I was hoping uh, I'd be able to do. Um, which is alright with me, because I might make that just a regular thing where I just uh, only record or I record that the day before and then release it, um, it might work out a little bit better that way rather than, you know, re trying to record it Saturday and upload it Saturday. Um, it might just make it a little bit easier on me to, to do it that way. Um, so, yeah, but that's pretty much what I've got going on uh, recently. Um, so, yeah, but let's... I'm going to do... A little bit of off-camera work on this floor and then uh, I'll make like a video cut here and then I will come back when I've kind of finished off.
Alright guys, so uh, I've been doing some more work here, and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that little montage I threw, threw together. I haven't really done one of those, and uh, that would be a pretty good experience to try and do one. And uh, Let me know what you guys think down below. I, I thought it was pretty good. Um, but yeah, anyway, we are going to go to the nether now, so let me quickly gather the materials I need. I need get some flint going. Let's see, can we... There we go. Alright, so we got a piece of flint. Let me quickly store some things. Mob drops there. Plant some food there. Um, we need a cobblestone. Take about, yeah, that'll be good enough. Put away some of those. Um, yeah, I'll put all of that away. And throw the gunpowder in there. Do we have any iron? Yeah. Get some iron out of here. Oops. The flint and steel. Put that away. Um, I think we're good to go to the nether, so let's quickly light this portal, and we'll get on in here. Hopefully there is a nether fortress somewhere around here. Um, anytime now. <laughs> Alright, let's see. We are... Interesting. Um, do we see another possibly one this way? Let me. Can I get close enough to render that? No. Um. Yeah, it looks like we've got uh, a decent starting area surrounded by lava. Yay. <laughs> um. I don't think I see any nether fortresses anywhere. Um, but yeah, let's head back through because I've got some more building ideas that we can do and I really don't want to spend too much time just running around in the nether. That'll be something I'll do off camera. But uh, so what I wanted to do now is work on just a little redstone project that we can do. Um, let me get some redstone. Um, what else do we need? We need some string. Because we don't have any string. Um, I don't think there'll be any spiders out. Um, yeah, I don't think there'll be any spiders anywhere out here. <laughs> hmm. As soon as I go to do something, there's nothing there to do it with, so. Um, let me come back to you guys when it's night, and then we will get the string. Alright guys, so it's about ready to turn night here, and uh, I guess we will wait for mobs to spawn somewhere around here. Um, I need a total of four string, because I'm going to be using some trip wires. Um, but I'll take as much string as I can get out of this, but hunt some spiders here and hopefully we can get uh, enough to at least make the dispenser that we need for this little redstone project.
they dropped the healing potion. That's interesting. Let's get rid of those. Take on this skeleton here. Drop a bow. Drop anything. Drop a bow. Alright. Take some leggings, I guess. Um, we are completely out of food now. <laughs> After that mob battle. Um, so 28 rotten flesh, but like 3 string, really. Um, we'll have to figure out a way to to find more or else I'm, I'm wondering if this bow uh, will be enough to craft another one let me get this mob drops just for right now put that in there um, there get some of these things put away Alright, let's see, can we make a dispenser? Made that wrong. Making it all wrong. No, I can't make a dispenser, darn it. Alright, so we'll have to make a, another bow here. Bow, redstone. Now we can make a dispenser. So we'll have to find some more string. But uh, what I want to do is build a boat launching pad. And I uh, figured we'd do it right here. So what I want to do is have a dispenser here that will dispense a boat. And then we're going to need to make another dispenser to put here to make a water dispenser and then basically what will happen is if we um, press a button it will uh, power these two um, this boat and this boat dispenser and uh, and uh, water dispenser I want to test something real quick Make sure I'm not doing this all wrong. If we put a dispenser here with a boat, and uh, let's, we'll just make a button. Put a button next to it. Oops. Yeah, that will dispense a boat. Okay. Making sure that's I'm not doing that all wrong. Yeah. So hopefully we can gather enough string to finish this project here. But as for right now, we'll put that in there. And I have no idea, just throw the button there. Um, but yeah, let's quickly jump down here. Uh, we've got the grass spreading uh, a bunch here. So that way we can get these grass floors going. There's dirt already there. Um, but yeah, so let's let me quickly gather some more materials and we're going to work on one last thing before we uh, end the episode. Alright guys, so for the final project of this episode, what we're going to do is make a sugarcane farm. Because um, I need some paper for the maps that we're going to be making. Um along that uh, wall that we built. Get out of the Why is there so many pigs around here? It's ridiculous. Um, let's get out. Go someplace else. Thank you. Um, basically, we're going to build out this direction. To here. And then we'll do the same along here. And then do the same along here. And we're going to keep doing this pattern once I get uh, enough dirt to do to keep doing this pattern. And then we'll have uh, a ton of sugar cane growing here so that way we can use for you know, paper to make books for the enchantment table. 
or anything else like that. So let's quickly put down some sugar cane. And that should be good. I want to keep three on me because I want to do one last thing before we end the episode. If I have the materials. Alright, so we are going to make an enchantment table and get the enchantment table achievement. So, we need paper. We're also going to need four obsidian. And we'll make a book. Two diamonds. Some obsidian. And then we make a enchantment table. So, with the enchantment table. Um, I'm trying to think where. I guess we'll just throw it down in our storage area for right now until we can make an enchantment room. But uh, that will be another project for another episode. Anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching. If you like the episode, please leave a like. Um, I thank everybody who's subscribed recently and left comments, guys. You guys. Are, uh, truly awesome and I want to thank you guys for doing that uh, it means a whole lot to me and uh, yeah so we will be ending the episode off here but anyway guys thank you guys for watching and I'll see you later bye bye